It's spring, and that means the insects are returning. So, let's talk about bees. The A to Z challenge continues, and today we're doing the letter B. So, I thought spring is a good time to talk about bees. Plus, they've been in the news a bit recently. Number one, there are around 20,000 known species of bee. Number two, the smallest bees are stingless bees that are only two millimeters in length. Number three, the largest bees are the Wallace's giant bee. It's a kind of leaf cutter bee that grows to 39 millimeters in length. Number four, although collection of honey dates back to 15,000 years, Beekeeping didn't start until about 4,500 years ago in ancient Egypt. Number five, a bee's mouth parts are adapted to both chew and suck, having both mandibles and a proboscis. Number six, the explosion of flowering plants 120 million years ago did not coincide with the appearance of bees, which came around about 100 million years ago, evolving from wasps. Number seven, a third of our food supply depends on pollinators most of which are bees. Number eight, honey isn't the only thing humans eat. In some countries, we even eat the larvae. Number nine, the decline in bees has been a major worry in recent years and has been linked to various problems such as pesticides, loss of habitat, and climate change. Number 10, it was once said that the bumblebee's flight was impossible. We now know that the short wing strokes, rotation of the wings, and rapid wing beats result in sufficient lift. They're not impossible flyers now. If you enjoyed this video about bees, then please give it a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to learn more scientific facts, then please subscribe. And click on the bell icon to receive notifications. I'm JD Archer for Science Not Just a Theory.